I think the ones that have to do with students. I, I do believe a lot of institutions have gotten away from the importance of why we're really there. Mm -hmm. And if you think about it, the students are the core of why institutions truly exist. There's a lot that goes on with research, uh, there's a lot that goes on with publishing, but the students are the reason that we're really there. I think what was very interesting is that most of them, with the exception of probably security, they're not technology specific issues. They're all higher ed issues for which IT and technology has answers maybe or can certainly support those issues to further the mission of the institution. You are not in the basement anymore. We are not just about transactional systems. We are about really the, the, the affecting the whole culture and students' experience and everybody's experience. We are way beyond effective and efficiency. We are about transformation. I was pleasantly surprised with the um, attention to data and, in, and, and, and sort of integration, platform integration, data migration, that was sort of novel. I think people are starting to recognize the value of data and the importance of data on a campus, especially around business intelligence and analytics and ultimately to AI. Actually, two of the items were about the data analytics. At Marquette, we're really focusing right now on becoming more of a data-driven organization, so figuring out how do we analyze the data, how we pull the right data together, how do we get the campus on board in using the data. That's probably the area that uh, most resonates with me. The issue of uh, student success, student experience, and what surrounds it, and in my opinion, is analytics, data, a decision made based on data because it's data that actually is going to tell you if the decision you have made are correct or not based on the results. So you need to close that loop. There's some things on that list about governance that's really, really important on university campuses. Research is a big part of it. So you wind up having these silos all over of people uh, actually having IT that's a little bit decentralized from centralized IT. And because of that, you really, really need to have a good governance structure. I think what's missing from the list is really high level thinking around what's on the list. So it's about governance, it's about policy setting, it's about real, it's about leadership. I think from a CIO perspective, that's what resonates with me the most, sitting at the table when decisions are being made around strategy, um, budget, you know, having the ability to understand how leadership works, to understand how people interact with each other, to understand um, sort of the high level thinking that goes into what makes, what, what ends up appearing on the list.